Hello and welcome to my channel. Today is my last day in the Philippines. I'm staying in a hotel right near Manila Airport, the Terminal 3, and decided to come out for a little walk and carry out a POV. So I'm walking towards the end where there's a bit more money. There's the branded shops up this end and a casino, and I've seen a Lamborghini. So here I've actually got the Canon M50 Mark II with me and you can see I've got the kit lens on. This is a great travel camera, great travel kit lens and I want to see what sort of shots we can get on my last day in the Philippines. We're going to walk up this end and then walk the other way where there's not quite so much money around and you can see where the two merge together so up here I've seen my first shot there's a traffic policeman I just want to get a few warm-up shots so let's get a shot here of him there we go so I'm zoomed in at 38 millimeters and we've got another worker watering the uh, bushes here just to get a feel of the light it's quite bright but actually when you go into the shadows it seems quite dark not many people around to be honest up this end so I'm going to get a look up shot here again just to get the feel of the light and how things are working but I quite liked this bridge and the glass and you can see I'm at 15 millimeter there so that's the widest for this particular lens and then I'm using this railing as a leading line and people walking through, we've got shadows and light. And then in London, I would take photos of buses. So I noticed these red buses over here. So I thought these would take a nice picture. I've zoomed into about 19 millimeter there. And we've got a motorbike coming down here. So I thought it'd be good to get that one. You can always get pictures of motorbikes in the Philippines. And here's another one with a, looks like a security guard just leaning over his motorbike, or it could be a policeman. And then I really love the reflections in this hotel. So I'm just going to line this one up and get a reflection shot here. really happy with that one and then I thought I'd better get another one to show this is the Marriott Hotel and further along here's a security guard I thought this will tell a nice story it's absolutely lovely weather here nice and hot and then an umbrella so we don't have to wait for rain in the Philippines they use umbrellas to keep the sun off. And we've got another traffic cop. I thought that would take a nice picture. And another one of him. And they do keep the place clean. There's always people sweeping and cleaning up. And I thought... That'll tell a nice little story. And then I quite like the shape on the ground here. It sort of led through to that person. We've got shadows. And then we've got this cyclist. I've used the tree there as a bit of a frame. He did notice me. And then we've got umbrellas again. You can see I've zoomed into 45 millimeter there. And then we've got this trike coming through. And you see trikes are a different shape in Manila. Uh, if you've watched my other videos uh, in 
and Sikihor and Dermageti. They're a different type of trike. And I just thought I'd get the scene because we've got leading lines here, these leading lines and shadows going through to that scene. Just had to get this cyclist. Now we've moved up to the other end now where the there's a merge of the sort of not quite so well off merges with the well off. And again they're still cleaning up. And then I quite like this background, so I'm going to wait for a subject to walk through. And here they come now. That's it. Quite happy with that one. There's a different type of trike there, or maybe call it a tuk-tuk. in the streets street food there's lots of street foods in the Philippines and we've got another trike you just can't help taking photos of trikes and I really love this one because you can see these vehicles are all colored and really nice and wherever you go in the world you will probably find a McDonald's so I just had to take a picture of this one and then we've got people on their phones. Wherever you are in the world, you can get photos just like this. And then we've got this couple, two up on a bike. And then I quite like this look up here. So I'm taking a look up shot of this building. In another one here we've got the tree and reflections in this building it's really nice reflections I thought the tree in the foreground just looked really nice cats just lazing about in the Sun so I just had to take a snap of one of these vehicle coming across the crossing I thought that made a nice picture and then I'm just doing another look up here this is really nice with the tree in the foreground the blue sky etc and then people crossing the road and then I've got another cyclist coming here I thought I'd just wait until they get to the crossing because of the colours and then this chap's t-shirt is the same colour as the building I'm sure it's a uniform to go with it see how they're cleaning up all the time to make it really nice going for another look up here just love the reflections in this one with the tree in the foreground and here we've got street food but in a small building and then again I like this particular building across the road with the blues leading up to the blue sky and the tree in the foreground and we've got another crossing so I thought that'd take a nice photo and then this background here I just wanted to wait for a subject to walk through because I've got the green in the front and then use that as a bit of a frame and it all blends in very nicely just get another one there in fact she had a nice mask on that blended in as well and then another background with the subject walking through the 
just one with a security guard here very laid back and relaxed anyway I hope you liked that video if you did please give me the thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed yet please consider subscribing and click that notification bell so that you don't miss future videos so I've just noticed up here a traffic policeman just standing there and I thought that'd be quite nice framed with the trees and here's just a few other snaps that I didn't capture on the GoPro and I really look forward to seeing you in the next video